I wasn't sure how I was going to do this video because this video involves two people, Conundrum and Kiyoma. So I'm not going to do anything in order here, I'm just going to show you what's what, and that will be the end of it. So let us get started on this dumpster fire of petty internet beefs. Believe me, if you were in my neck of the woods, my friend, oh, you would have a beat. There will be a beat down. And I'll make sure to bust your fucking face over a pipe wrench. That, ladies and gentlemen, is Conundrum. And let me tell you all about what kind of person he is and how I met this dude. It all started on your average video game lover stream where he was talking about video games, anime, sports, or whatever he was talking about at the time. And our good old buddy Conundrum pops into the chat and said some shit to VGL. And Conundrum at the time was good buddies with, you guessed it, Retro Gaming Star. He even went as far as to make a live stream on VGL, all because VGL made a video on this guy. So, we are going to play this clip where VGL responds to Conundrum. So, give me one second. And here we go. So this is an unplanned video because apparently some guy by the name of the Conundrum called me out. So, I'm going to respond to this dumbass because he made a 12 minute temper tantrum live stream all because I made fun of his comment in the live stream last night. Keep in mind, I don't even know who this guy is. This dude came to my live stream out of nowhere, but no one told him to watch my live stream. He came to my live stream and then said about the console war. And he says, instead of this console war fanboy crap, why don't we follow up? Why don't we really target on how the left wing media is destroying gaming and all these dang SJWs ruining gaming? Ah! That's basically what it was. And I simply just made fun of him because it's like, I don't care. That's not my, you're, that's not my fault. You have issues if Jacks end slavery in Mortal Kombat 11. Knowing this guy, I can tell this dude gets easily triggered just like that and in that live stream he got upset i was wearing a star wars force awakens film and i'm like feminists like that movie i'm like i found it in a thrift store and i wear it because i'm a star wars fan i wasn't a big fan of the sequel trilogy so the reason this dude got so butt hurt was because I was kind of making fun of him in that comment. And Savage Elder, which I didn't tell him to do this, he found his Discord and he tried to link it in the comment section. And the, and the, pro, the funny thing was, the link was messed up. So he didn't even know how to do a Discord link properly. So this dude gets so butt hurt, he blocks me. Which is funny because he complains how, how Video Game Level 58 blocked me. You blocked me. Because my comment disappeared. Because when I called you out, my comment was gone. So don't even lie about that crap, Calendrum. Then this dude spends time making fun of my appearance, which is funny because this dude is literally the most geekiest dude you ever meet. He's almost 300 pounds, and he has some nerve to talk about my appearance? Seriously, fuck off. So, then, I guess because he thought that the title of the live stream was an attack on 3-frame when it wasn't, he thinks I'm a fan of Darius Truxton and Flat Earth Gamer. I don't even like Darius Truxton. In fact, I despise him because I think he's a complete asshole who tries to be a comedian, but he fails at it. I'm surprised he has never made a video on me. I'm very surprised at that, but that might happen really soon. And Flatter Gamer, I literally called him out in the start of the live stream because the whole point was he got butt hurt along with that other guy, that Mendez guy, got mad because 
three frame is sub to my channel and he likes my content and they got so butthurt about it they unsubbed me so i literally made a video mocking them so the fact that you have a lot of audacity to lie to your own people you're like minuscule school 10 10 sub fan base or like the 10 people that watch your garbage content you're just gonna lie straight in their face so mr calendrum if you want to continue this crap i can go beyond i can go to your live stream and we can really hash it out I would des I would definitely bury your ass again if necessary. People are just so easily triggered these days. I mean, my God, all over a Star Wars shirt, man. All over a Star Wars Force Awakens shirt. Oh boy, man. This is probably why he's a, a lonely basement dweller. So, take it easy. So, VGL went into the stream and him and Conundrum finally squashed their beef. Everything is all said and good now, right? Well, recently, he made a live stream where he thinks that anybody that I associate with is a racist. And I am apparently part of the KKK, aka the CEO of racism. I'm this big bad guy that they they want off YouTube. These guys want me off YouTube so bad that they're willing to make up shit about me. Just like the time where Conundrum accused Retro of being a pedophile. So Conundrum does a seven hour stream with Kiyoma talking shit about me. I'm not going to play all seven hours of this clip, so I will just give you the highlights of what they said about me. So, give me one sec to pull this up. Alright, uh, where is it? Alright, here we go. Alright, now, here's the funny thing. During this whole... Let me this go back to you. The whole thing, after all this drum, we found out it was caused by one person. And you talk about one we person. all got Houston Ocean's Eleven. Bamboozled. Bamboozled. We got Ocean's Eleven. Mm -hmm. uh. Quite literally, I didn't even see this Ocean's Eleven trick coming. And the only reason we figured out past the Ocean's Eleven was because we literally, oh. quite literally, cracked an acronym. Mm -hmm. Which was set up. Oh, that's at the Colonel. Oh my gosh, I hate people like this with me. I'm, I'm, I'm out. Oh. Oh, man. Yeah, yep, yep, yep. I see why. Just that design and the voice I heard last night, man. Mm hmm. Oh, death. Come on, get on with it. He's worse shit. than that captain in uh, Day of the Living, Day of the Dead. Come on, get on with it. But apart from that, it was thanks to an acronym that we stumbled upon that we found out the one that had been causing that new that caused cat server that caused mine and caused me to have an Oh yeah, they down. apparently um, think I raided somebody's server, which never happened. Was someone we thought we trusted the whole time. And it's always caught me strange was he would ne we would ask for certain information he wouldn't give it, but he would give a lot of other information and when pressed, he squeals. Even though I talked to you behind the scenes know, and the man you wouldn't give me any proof that I'm Regina lover. Well, and I'll talk about that in a minute. Racist. Um, racist. And, 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 and in my eyes, he's a KKK member. There you go, people. He thinks I'm a KKK How member. I don't remember when you stream something and you and yet you have the ability to uh, unlist it. Yeah. And and yet yeah. you can answer certain questions cognitively mm -hmm. and you can yeah. thing. Yeah. Now you're probably going, why do you think it's this specific person? Mm -hmm. Well, before we get it, 
He is an obsession mm -hmm. with chewing gum and Tensei, and that has a lot of Hmm, I wonder who they're talking about. Yeah. Can anyone in chat tell me what the He's obsessed with Shimmy Gang Tensei. The significance of 3 a.m. is. Just wanna hear that. 3 a.m. What the fuck message. are they talking about? This is interesting to 3 a.m. Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, uh, the stream cutouts. That's, uh. That's their end, not mine. Oh, sweet. Ban! Ban his ass! Goodbye! Alright, so I went into the stream and I was like, hmm, I wonder who they're talking about. And they immediately banned my ass. Because <laughs> they're that fucking scared of me. Hi, you from channel. Bye bye, bitch! You thought I was watching. I don't, I don't, uh, support the KKK. I'm not that a KKK man member. There is a KKK member. No. And that is the man we were going to get to. Which, by the way, I've already apologized to Kage behind the scenes. Like, you can ask Kage about this shit. Like, I told him I, I, I apologized. Like, what else do they fucking want? I mean, if they don't want to accept my apologies, that's on them, like I said. Speak of the devil and he shall appear. Well, yeah, because you're talking about me. Exactly. Now, if you look at that avatar, that is officially death in Shin Megami Tensei. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they think Hellbiker is the symbol of death. <laughs> Hellbiker. They're so scared of Hellbiker. That's fucking hilarious. <laughs> I do not like racism. Racist will be banned. And anybody who supports a racist will be banned. I hate racism. The man used the hard R of the uh, slay, uh, uh, of the racial store in front of another black man. Okay, yeah. I'm not gonna get Which again, I've already yeah. apologized. Uh, for, for the bars. Yeah. So racism is not allowed in my f eyes. And it's funny that he shows up right as we're streaming. I guarantee you, because this is a trend, since he's been here, if you get Again, ready, if you talk ready, about me, of course I'm going to fucking show up. Yeah. We know and I don't... Let me give you a piece of advice. The more you talk about me, the more ammo you fucking give me. I don't think these guys realize that. The more they talk about me, the more ammo they give me. It's ridiculous. I don't care about him. I, I never liked racism. And the only reason why I brought this up is because I hate the fact he called one of my good friends the N bomb. And he's not even apologetic about it. I'm not apologetic, motherfucker. I just apologized like four or five times now already. What more do you want? I was drunk on moonshine. And I don't know where I got it. I was drunk on moonshine, which is true. I was. Do you even know what moonshine is? Yes, I do. What is, what's your fucking point? Dude, I come from the sticks. That shit's hard to get a hold of. It's potent as shit, but I can guarantee... Well, not in my area. It's, they're easy to, it's easy to get, but I don't know what your fucking point is. Dude, you are plastered. Yeah. Yes, I was. I was plastered. Yeah. Yeah will knock you on your ass. Yep. True. I'm not disputing it. Of course it's gonna get you shit-faced. Like, we've all said things that we don't fucking mean. Like, I, like, for example, I said the N-word over and over again. I've said that. I will admit that. Yes. I, I don't know what these guys are getting at. They, especially if it's been stilled. Mm -hmm. Like, take Libra October, for instance. He got drunk one time, and he made a video saying that he wanted the whole world to end. Oh, I, I want the whole world to end, and um, it's everything's all doom and gloom. Which, he was drunk, and I, 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 will, I will admit, I, I don't think he means that. We all say shit we don't fucking mean. That's the point here. Before you think it's too to have to no, know, no, no, yeah. no, seven Illinois. Yeah. There are people where out in the country where we, where, mm -hmm. where we grow uh, 
soybeans and uh, corn yeah. and uh, other ones. Mm -hmm. They quite literally have those out. Yeah. All right, so that's that. Um, let me put the music back on for a second. Where the fuck's my music? All right, so here's another clip where Conundrum wants to kill me in a video game, and he blocks VGL. Let me find that clip. Because it's fucking hilarious. Alright, here's the clip. There's the where there's the one where he blocks VGL. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, video game lover. You leave me no choice for what your actions are. For supporting racism, you get the block. Apparently he he supports racism. I don't know why. All right, so that's the one clip. Uh, let me find the other clip where he wants to kill me in a video game. Here's this one. Oh, a kid. A newt? Yeah. Not anymore. See what you're about to do is you're about to discipline GBA. <laughs> yeah. They're gonna discipline this me. This is my boomstick. <laughs> They're gonna discipline me. Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, these guys are hilarious. Ah, <laughs> uh, anyways. Um, what was I gonna say? Wait, let me put this clip back on. Turn this down a bit. So, another thing I wanted to address is Conundrum and his buddies trying to get my personal information and how they did it was they looked up my YouTube name and tried to see if I have any dirt or any deep dark secrets that I didn't want the whole world, the whole white world to know about. And they failed miserably. So they think at first they think that I'm like a black guy one minute and the next thing they think that I'm some random woman on DeviantArt which I'm neither one of those so try again detective conundrum and Kiyoma you're not going to find dirt on me you fools failed to dox me so good job on that you even failed to provide evidence show proof that I raided your server or that I'm Regina lover I asked both of you behind the scenes when Jacob got everybody together to settle this petty shit. I asked you personally, where is the proof that I am Regina Lover? Conundrum, Kiyoma, and John, I asked these guys personally, where's, my, where's your fucking proof that I'm this person? Could not do it. And do you know what their response is? Oh, somebody gave me this information and we're not going to show it. You know, you just have to wonder who that certain somebody is. I mean, if they're not willing to show proof that I'm Regina Lover, or that I raided their Discord servers, then that tells me that they're full of shit. Now that I think about it... Ugh, excuse me. Now that I think about it, I do remember Conundrum telling people that he was going to get his commentary buddies to make videos on Retro, but... Since they're on good terms with him, I wonder if they're going to do a video on me now. I would love to see that. I mean, I just, I want a good fucking laugh. And that's another thing. These guys are afraid of me, like I've said. I gave them an open platform, an open opportunity last time to say whatever they wanted to, to say on my stream, but they couldn't do it. So, Kiyoma and Conundrum. If you want to come on and disprove everything I have said, so then show me proof. Go for it. Make a response on this video. I want to see the proof that I am what you think I am. Uh, let's see. There is a question that they asked me as well, and I want to address this too. They said, why do you unlist your videos? To put it simply, because I can. 
and apparently that is one of their proofs that I'm reaching a lover somehow. I don't know. Anyways, I would love to go on and tell you all this conspiracy shit that Kiyoma and John would love to throw at me, but I think I'll save that for another time. So until then, you guys take care, and I hope you all enjoy this dumpster fire. Have a good one. Are you the fiend who has been seduced by the power of darkness?